Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whoever and wherever you are, this is Lee, and we're on the Game of Tongues, where we work on speech anxiety in all its forms. And right now, we have with us Asai. Say hello, Asai. Good morning, good morning. And this, today, Asai is going to, he's from Puerto Rico, and he came to us in April of this year. And he posted his success story not long ago. And the purpose of this video is to give him a chance to tell us um, more or less uh, his his speech story. So with that, I'll give you the, the mic, Asai, and tell us what you can. All right. So this is my success story. After experiencing an event that would threaten my career, I had enough, right? So I live in Puerto Rico. I have blocked, stuttered, and even accompanied those with awkward gestures since I was approximately four, or maybe five. This was true for phone calls, in front of groups, authority figures, and even friends, family, and strangers, especially strangers. My blocking was so extreme that I could not read aloud couldn't even present myself or have normal conversations in a normal way. And as you can imagine, I was a situational person who stuttered. Some days my stuttering was minimal and other days I stuttered and blocked on every other word. Throughout the years, my stuttering did improve naturally, but it was still a disability. So after joining the military, I experienced how hard it was for a PWS to manage in a fluent world. But I did manage. I worked hard and I excelled in every aspect of my life except in my speech. So I basically compensated for my lack of speech. I did a few therapy sessions when I was young, but nothing worked. Nothing improved my stuttering. I spent a long time believing that stuttering was just there. And it could not be cured. I believed I had to deal with it for the rest of my life, even though I've already realized that I did not stutter when speaking alone, when reading aloud, or talking to some friends. How bizarre is that? But I bet that some people who stutter can definitely see that. One day, stuttering threatened my career, like I said, and I had enough. So I researched the internet and found Lee Lovett's book, I started hearing the audible version of the second edition, and I waited to receive my hard copy. This was in the COVID-19 lockdown. <laughs> By the time I was done reading the book, my starring started to abate, and it was diminishing. I was gaining fluency in casual conversations with friends, strangers, and family, and over the phone. I did diligently follow the methods and techniques outlined in the book while reading aloud. I started practicing the crutches, which are very important, and most of all, applying mind training every single day. After reading the book, I started receiving coaching by Lee and then Javier. He's from Spain, a certified speech coach for Speech Anxiety Cures and Speech Anxiety Anonymous. I've had a lot I've had a total of five sessions between the two and counting. My speech continues to improve every single day, and my fear and anxiety, which are still there, are still diminishing, but in direct proportion with my stutter. My family, friends, and coworkers have commented on how my speech has improved. I have not had an event where my speech has been disabled. That is very significant since I started applying the methods. Even though I still have speech bumps, I'm determined to continue working the methods and become an excellent speaker and someday love to speak, which I'm sure I will. So they say the hardest part of the race is the last stride to the finish line, right? That last 1% to gain fluency, it's definitely the hard part. I have learned that stuttering can be cured and reversed. It is hard work. But it's not because of the nature of stuttering, but because you must believe that you can improve. And you must diligently 
and religiously continue the methods and techniques to strive for that 99.9% .9 of fluency. This takes time and dedication, but it is worth it. Never give up on trying and continue to be consistent with yourself. I urge any stutterer to join Speech Anxiety Cures and get all of Lee's speech books and read them and take the video courses that he did on H. At Speech Anxiety Cures, you're also finding a video library containing around 1,000 coaching videos. That's all our videos to watch. Watching them is much like private coaching. If you want a private coaching, it is available as well. In conclusion, you don't have to stutter, not anymore. I'm not stuttering right now. I can read aloud. I can talk to you fine. Life is ever so much better. Join us and start your new life. I did. And that's it. Thank you. That's 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 wonderful. I really that's that'll help a lot of people. Can you tell us what you're doing now, what you about your speech and what you plan for the future? Yes. So I continue doing my mind training. My so my mind training is definitely the number one cause of my cure. Reversing that mental state that allows you to stutter is key, right? And I continue reading aloud and practicing the crutches. The crutches are going to be your fail safe. They're going to avoid possible relapses. Uh, what crutches um, do you uh, have you used the most? Well, I've used a lot of word linkage and modulation, as well as dropping the first syllable of a word and adding an, an alternate word to that first feared word, and as well as a sound. Good, good. And on a daily basis, uh, what are you doing now? Are you working still on your speech? Or are you broadening it out to other things or, or what? I'm definitely still working on my speech. Like I said, I'm still working on my fears. They're still there, but I'm determined to exterminate those fears. It is definitely possible. And I'm definitely conscious that fear is just a... Fear is just fear. It's not a stutter. You, and you, you mentioned speech anxiety cures. Um, the speech, it has a speech master's club. I know you attend it because I'm the host of it. Um, could you tell us uh, if that's helping, why you attend it, and what difference that makes? So uh, speech master's club is kind of like a, a meeting for people who stutter you know, to give talks, short talks, and give comments about those talks. And, you know, it builds one's confidence that you can speak to a multitude of people, right? That slowly helps the PWS with the fears. You know, it gives you more confidence that you can speak to a group of people. Most of the people who are at Speechmasters Club are PWSS, people who stop stuttering like yourself and who have posted success stories um, on that subject. And the others there are PWS who are fast becoming PWSS. Um, do you, does it help you to be a part of a club that's comprised primarily of people like that? That's right. Um, watching people who used to stutter and give speeches that are absolutely great. You know, it makes me want to be a part of that. Um, those kindred spirits, you know, it motivates me to be just like them and become even better, a better person. You know, um, like you said a lot of the times, Lee, it's about healing the whole person. That's a perfect ending. I want to thank you very much for that. It's, that's a wonderful success video, and I'm sure many people will be inspired by it. Uh, so thanks for it.